Today is the final day of the UC Board of Regents meeting at UC Merced. And protesters have returned once more to make their voices heard. CBS 47's Jason Toktagian live at the pro-Palestine encampment with an update on today's demonstrations. That's right, Catherine and Brian. Pro-Palestine supporters again making their voices heard inside and outside the UC Board of Regents meeting that happened a little bit earlier today. Now, a meeting was agreed upon between some of those regents and the protesters right here on the encampment, but it didn't happen without a few bumps in the road. The third and final day of the UC Board of Regents meeting wrapping up at UC Merced this afternoon. I don't know how you can stand here in front of us and act like everything is okay when it is indeed not. Protect your students, do the right thing, and divest now. Just a couple hundred feet away from that meeting, a pro-Palestine encampment has remained since May 12th. Protesters telling me they're hoping for more dialogue between them and the UC Regents. In our negotiations with the administration, we're asking them to use their positionality to try and get us meetings with some of the higher uh, ranking regents rather than just the student regents. Around noon today, UC Regents approached the encampment to talk to protesters during their lunch break, but there wasn't much dialogue shared. We had six Board of Regents come in. Um, they had a, a security team as well. However, there were two hecklers. Uh, we had six seats set up for the Regents. Um, and two of the hecklers took those seats and then proceeded to um, intercept every time we tried to ask a question. When the regents returned to their meeting, the hecklers also left the encampment. Around 3.30 this afternoon, five regents returned to the encampment to answer questions and talk about divestment from Israel. It's also unclear exactly how long the encampment will remain now that the UC regents are leaving Merced and that the summer semester begins May 20th. Until we are able to have tangible, written next steps provided by the administration, we're going to continue to organize throughout the summer with the other UCs and hopefully come back stronger as a system-wide unit. And to recap, five UC Board of Regents members did meet with protesters right behind me about 40, 45 minutes ago, and that meeting lasted for an hour. The key takeaway is that the UC Merced's administration wants to continue dialogue with students. But for now, reporting live in Merced, Jason Taktagian, CBS 47 Eyewitness News.